Hey you guys, welcome back to Shanghai China, I'm Andy. Today it is Monday the 10th of February 2020. Now don't be fooled by the beautiful weather because it is a balmy 7 degrees right now, so a little chilly. But today is a special day here in Shanghai because a lot of people are actually heading back to work. So what I'm going to do is now head down to the city centre and see if I can check out the situation uh, in a couple of office buildings, see how people are going. Let's see. Shocked you guys, I'm pleasantly surprised. Life seems to have returned to Shanghai. Okay, so this is HKRI centers, which is uh, two office towers that all together have about 15,000 white collar workers going to work every day. The numbers are significantly lower today, but there are people coming back today, which is really interesting. And there are a lot of measures in place to make sure the place is spick and span. So first things first, anything somebody might touch in the lobby here and in any common areas, uh, like turnstiles, uh, elevator buttons, uh, door handles, anything like that, will be sanitized every 15 minutes. Another one of the measures being taken is that the elevators at the moment can only take a maximum of six people at a time. And this is to keep a distance, a safe distance between people in the elevator. So these people lining up behind me are coming into the office for the first time since the novel coronavirus outbreak really took hold. Uh, so what they need to do is uh, fill in a form uh, and sign it that states they're in full health and they've uh, been checked up for their temperature and things like that before they're even allowed in. So it's serious stuff. Now one of the questions many people ask when returning to uh, office buildings during times like this is what happens in an office building with the air conditioning? Wouldn't that pass around the virus and get everybody sick? Well the answer is it's actually completely turned off and all that's blowing through the building is fresh air which is passed through a filter and also disinfected before it ever reaches your office. That's awesome. Okay, this cute little guy behind me is on patrol. He is looking out for unusual situations around the building, including fire, flooding, and unauthorized personnel. He can also disseminate information on novel coronavirus, including the need to wear a face mask. They've also told me they're training him so that in the very near future, he'll be able to find people who aren't wearing masks and give them a bit of a telling off. There's also this robot that can clean and disinfect the streets outside the building, saving time for human staff to make sure areas inside the building that may be touched are disinfected regularly. So I have to say it's been really interesting checking out how Shanghai office buildings are preparing for the return to work after the Chinese New Year with the novel coronavirus situation. I have to say I'm feeling quite confident. Okay you guys, that's it for today. I'll see you again tomorrow. Bye-bye.